I also think of it in think of it in terms of the the era of deconstruction, which is one of the things I'd like us to call the era that's now ending. The era of deconstruction was the era that started, let's say, from the sixties onwards, and was originally an academic game that then spilled out into the wider culture, which was, let's take everything apart. Let's pull it all apart. Um, there are lots of problems with it. One is it's quite boring. Uh, you don't get an awful lot from it. Uh, you also have the problem of what children find when they try to do this with bicycles, which is they can take it apart quite easily, but they can't put it back together. Um, and the era of of taking things apart as a game is one we've lived through and it's been highly destructive. But you can do it for quite a long time. I'm going to look at this society and I'm going to take it apart by showing systemic problems. I'm going to... At the end of that, what have you got? What have you done? What have you achieved? We need to interrogate this. Okay, interrogate. By all means, ask questions. But interrogate as a deliberate as hostility to this. I'm going to interrogate this thing and take it apart. And again, at the end of it, what have you got? Whether you're interrogating a text or a piece of music or an idea or a society, fine. Question, endlessly question. Yes, interrogate. Assumes it's all um, a criminal in a cell and it's guilty and therefore it must be taken apart. And that's what we've been doing for decades in the West. And that's resentment. That's one byproduct of resentment. You can't build the thing, but you know how to take it apart.